Okay. I don't know what to say. I just realized I hit record and I don't know what to say. Hello. It has been a minute since I have vlogged and I, I know not what to say. I just hit record thinking that it would come to me and it didn't. So. Hi there, my name is Joe. And I'm Jessica. We are homeschooling natural living entrepreneurs. This is a story of how we balance it all for the freedom to live our lives devoted to our family and faith. Thanks for stopping by, subscribe, and come on in. I don't know, I'm like, what do I say? And then it just, it comes to you. All right, so it's Saturday. Uh, so we're trying an experiment. I'm hoping that it's gonna go well. Uh, in retrospect, I realized that the turnout may not be as great because I really didn't market it the way that I had planned to in my head. Uh, so learning experiences, learning experiences, but we'll see how the turnout is. But we did load all of our bins with stuff. I've got lots of stuff in that front area as well, hoping that people are gonna come in. Um, it seems like the people who come in, they wanna come back and I think that's really where um, like the sales are gonna come in with, with like customer service uh, treating people like family, which is something that Joe and I do, I would say, very well. Um, and so, yeah, I'm thinking, you know, really catering to them, having things grow organically, but then putting our stuff in front of the most people in our community as possible. So I'm going to try and straighten up a little bit, uh, get some music going, try to get some, I don't know, we'll figure it out. We'll see what happens. I thought that since we are here today, I would go ahead and do some shipping this morning. Uh, so that maybe Monday morning will not be as busy shipping. I don't know, I just feel like either for me or Whitney, whoever does the shipping on Monday mornings, it usually it kind of like wipes out uh, a good portion of the day because we've been shipping well over 100 orders uh, on Mondays. And today we've got 22 orders in one store, 18 orders in the other store, and then I've got a few three Facebook marketplace sales uh, that I've got to do there. So lots of shipping. I'm gonna go ahead and get that done because I have no idea what time they're gonna be coming today because it's Saturday. All I know is I've scheduled a pickup request and that they'll be here at some point. Okay, so it is closing time. Uh, we've been here for about four hours. We made about $300 in sales. Um, and that's with the BOGO discount. Um, one of the, my favorite things about today that I really liked was that there was a lot of people that came in in different, in groups. Um, we had like lulls where there was nobody in here. And then we had groups where there were people, um, like multiple families, like coming in and shopping. And in that, I was able to kind of see what people are looking at, what people are interested in, what people are picking up. So I'm able to this week really kind of adjust some things um, just to make it a better shopping experience for everyone. So I'm pretty excited about it. Um, we're getting packed up getting ready to head home um and rest for the remainder of the afternoon and i'm i'm pretty excited about it it was a good day what do you think good day yeah good day lucas good day hmm? was today a good day where's papa where's papa he's at home was today a good day <laughs> maybe today wasn't that great for him It's Tuesday now. I had every intention to film on Sunday and Monday, but I don't know, man. Sunday uh, was a lazy day for us. We did some cleaning around the house, but we pretty much just rested, hung out, relaxed, uh, kind of all just did some self-care, I guess you would say. You know, we kind of all did our own thing. I played some Madden, Jessica watched some of her show, did her nails, um, dyed her hair, which you'll see uh, at some point soon, uh, along with JoLynn's hair, which JoLynn's hair isn't finished yet. She just started the process. Uh, she will finish it after uh, the last swimming lesson this week. Um, so it was nice. And then yesterday was busy. We had lots of orders to ship out. Even though we shipped out 40 something orders on Saturday, we still shipped out 110 orders yesterday. So we would have actually shipped out 
a hundred and over 150 items uh, yesterday uh, had we not shipped some on Saturday so it was good it was it's been a busy couple days of sales so I'm very encouraged about that although yesterday the sales in store were very very slow uh, but that seems to be the case on Mondays. Uh, we'll get a couple people around lunch, and then we'll get a couple people towards the end of the day. But today is the first day that we'll be opening until 7, or staying open until 7 o'clock. So I'm hoping that we get some traffic uh, in the evening time. Um, if not, I mean, it'll be a bummer. Yes, it won't be a loss, though, because Dedrick will be here. He can list stuff. Uh, which will be, I guess, a secondary task for him. Um, the primary would be taking care of customers out front, front building that rapport uh, with those uh, individuals. So that, I don't know, that's just something that you've heard me talking about it before. That's just a goal of ours. This a strategic goal is to build relationships with the people. That way it's not just about the product, it's about the service also. Uh, that's a way that we want to be able to differentiate ourselves. That it's they're not just coming to spend money. That it's it's more than just the transaction. I should say so. That'll be it, and then we'll stay open Thursday, and then we are closed this Saturday uh, because it is JoLynn's birthday. We're having a little get together. Uh, some friends, uh, mostly family, but a few friends are coming over to celebrate her birthday. Her, she's gonna be nine years old, which is crazy, crazy, crazy. And then the following week, next week, we're actually having a falling prices event, uh, which you would probably, if you've been to Ben stores, you know that's that's the typical format uh, for a lot of Ben stores is that the price is one amount on one day, then it lowers to the next amount and the next amount, and then there's no restocking or anything. We're going to do ours a little bit differently because we do have all of our items priced uh, already. Is that the first day, it should be Monday and Tuesday, will be regular price. We're going to stock up those days. And then starting on Wednesday, all items will be 20% off. Thursday, 40% off. Friday, 60% off. And then on Saturday, 80% off for those four or five hours that we will be open. And our hopes is to be able to blow out a lot of the inventory that we currently have uh, so that we can put more items out the following week. And um, we that's the week that we plan on probably closing for a few days so that we can go ahead and expand our bin store or the, the bin, the bins, you've heard me talk about the plan, uh, from nine bins to seven or to 16 bins. So we'll be almost doubling the amount of bin space that we have. Uh, so I'm excited about that. Uh, but this is where I'm going to leave you guys today because it's a little bit weird. Jessica's going to go see some friends later today. It is 7.12 in the morning. I've been here for almost an hour uh, so far uh, just doing payroll, um, going over drafts, going over sales, looking at different things. Um, and I'm about to start doing some listing because now that Dedrick isn't listing as much or working as much, he's not listing as much, I've got to make sure that I am listing more uh, to make sure that we're still keeping up with the goals that we have. So I appreciate you guys so much. Uh, until the next video, peace.